I am thrilled about the John Bonet Ramsey limited series coming to Paramount Plus. Now, if they would have just said that. Already, I'm excited. A scripted. We've got so many documentaries about this little angel. It's time. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> That's what I thought you were going to say. <laughs> it's time that we get a scripted drama to really sink our teeth into. So I would have watched it no matter what. I would have watched it if it was on Lifetime with some bitch I'd never heard of. But instead, we got it on Paramount Plus, an eight part. I made eight parts up, but it seems like how much we need. An eight part <laughs> limited series starring Melissa McCarthy and Clive Owen. Uh, Who are they playing? The parents. Oh, uh, okay. Incredible. Now, I do wish it was made in the early 2000s slash late 90s so we could have had, imagine this cast, Sandra Bullock as the mother. Of course. And Dakota Fanning as John Bonet. But we can't have that, so I'll settle for Melissa McCarthy and Clive Owen. Now, John Bonet will have to be an unknown, I think. We don't have any stars that shine as bright as she did at that mm. age. Isn't it kind of strange, though, to like be bringing in a child actor to portray a child star that was exploited and taken advantage of? Somebody's got to do it. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> I guess so. Is Ryan Murphy behind the helm? He's not. I wish he was, because then it would really be trashy. I'm afraid it's going to be too, like, middle ground, where they're not going to want to dramatize anything, and it'll just be boring. But people tell me, so I'm 38, you may know. People tell me all the time that I look anywhere from 28 to 31. Do you think if I shaved my facial hair, I could play 11, and I could play Burke? I hate you <laughs> so much. <laughs> People tell me I look between 28 and 31. Who? They really do. Show me the Anyone. Receipts. Boys and girls. Because if it was just boys, I would say it's like when boys used to tell me I look like Megan Fox because they just wanted to fuck I me. I don't know if you could get away with an 11. I think it would be a hard 11. <laughs> Burke is a hard 11. You did once during a recording look at yourself the way you love to do because for whatever reason it must have been a Halloween episode but you were wearing a blonde wig and you did spend the majority of our recording looking at yourself and saying that and I quote I look just like John Bidet and now I remember it, and I did. I want to make a YouTube series or maybe reels where I am John Bidet vlogging from heaven like, hey, guys. <laughs> I don't know about that one, Donnie. I know that you do get your most creative inspiration from John Benet Ramsey. Hashtag never forget the advent calendar that you mm -hmm, created mm -hmm. in the workplace <laughs> to honor her. But mm -hmm. I don't know if a YouTube series where you're playing a dead 11-year-old child. No, I think she was like six. Burke was 11. <laughs> Great. Then you know what? That changes everything. <laughs> Go for it. I know nothing about this case. I'm pretending to know who Bert is. Burke is the brother. Bert? Burke. Oh, with a K? Yeah, Burke is the brother. That did it. You think so? Mm -hmm. We'll talk about it later. Okay, really quick. I think he did it, and the parents didn't want to lose two children. So mm. then they covered it up for him, which is why it's so sloppy. Because it wasn't a premeditated death, I don't think. I think the parents just had to work with what they had. And they had to give the old razzle-dazzle the way that they forced their daughter to do. Yeah. So if there's anyone that could play Burke, it is me. Great. Well, <laughs> I look forward to hearing your dissertations as that show comes out. Okay, so I want to talk about another show 